Here's WVTM 13's Rick Carley in Orlando, rolling with the tide. New Year's Eve for the Crimson Tide was all about business. The last practice before the big game and last words from the coach. Oh, and it also meant Bama fans got down to business as well. A huge Tuesday pep rally signaled to Bama fans that they've got the Iron Bowl set back and those two losses behind them. Oh, it's happening, sweetheart. All right, Shirlene, why is Woo! it happening? Huh? Roll Tide, baby, roll Tide. The Million Dollar Band, Big Al, cheerleaders, even Bama's head trainer enjoyed the moment. Does anybody ever ask how you're feeling? My wife occasionally will ask me how I'm feeling. So every <laughs> once in a while, she'll, how you doing? I'm, but no. And Bama's star quarterback, for a moment, that jersey had us fooled. Tua, excuse me, you got a minute? Yeah. How's the hip? <laughs> that was fine, fine, fine. Where's my, where's my walker at? The Bama Nation has pushed the reset button, and they're ready to scare away any Michigan fan in their midst. Sir. Yes. You lost? Uh, no, I'm found, actually. They say an elephant never forgets. And while the Bama Nation will never forget those few 2019 setbacks, you know, you lose two games, you're ready to drive off the cliff. What's with you people? They plan on remembering a huge Citrus Bowl win. It's not about the past, it's all about the future and what we got to prepare. Michigan's a tough opponent. You uh, related to Nick Saban? I am a distant cousin. So look, that's the message. On Wednesday, they don't want a stinking loss. They want a W, right? That's it from Orlando. Rick Carley, WVTM 13.